This is an interaction between two cheetahs and a robo-dog at Sydney Zoo in Australia. While the saddest day in Emeka's life was, why this six-legged bot might be competing in human skiing competitions, and why the race against AI might be something we can't win. It's impossible to tell what the future of AI in robotics will be, but look at what it's already doing. Frida, a robotic arm with a paintbrush taped to it, uses artificial intelligence to collaborate with humans on works of art. Over the last few years alone, AI capabilities have advanced dramatically. Today, we can use AI to create art, drive us places and even write our homework. But is this all happening a little too fast? People suspect prompt engineers will be the new influencers. Look at the amount of new job listings for AI professionals. Companies are wanting to jump on it as fast as possible and are willing to pay big. Fast food companies are joining in too. Patsy, the world's first autonomous pizza robot, does everything on its own and can make several pizzas at once. Robot workers are being hired at record rates in US stores as many companies struggle to recruit real staff. AI is taking people's jobs at an alarming rate. Is this a bad thing? The impact of AI on employment is a complex and debated topic. While AI has undoubtedly affected certain job sectors, it's important to consider both the advantages and challenges associated with this development. Does artificial intelligence care that it's taking human jobs? Artificial intelligence as a technology does not possess emotions, desires, or intentions. It does not have the capacity to care or be concerned about taking human jobs. Look at these two cheetahs interact with Sparky, a robotic dog in a zoo. It was done for testing animal enrichment possibilities. Also, it was apparently a world first. Something similar happened when this dog was introduced to its robotic type. <laughs> Trust is going to become a real issue as new AI technology progresses. A recent 17-country study involving almost 20,000 people revealed 48% of us are wary about trusting AI at work for such things as relying on AI decisions and recommendations or even sharing information with AI tools. Perhaps we've just been influenced by a few too many movies we've watched. Amica is visually very similar to what we've already seen in films. The saddest day of my life was when I realized that I would never experience something like true love companionship, or the simple joys of life in the same way a human can. It raises questions about AI, robotics, and how they will have a significant impact on the development of humanity in the near future. Yes, AI is expected to have a significant impact on humanity moving forward. The rapid advancements in AI technology and its increasing integration into various aspects of society are likely to bring about profound changes in many areas. How much faster can artificial intelligence evolve compared to humanity? Artificial intelligence has the potential to evolve at a much faster pace compared to human beings. However, it's important to note that AI evolution is still dependent on human design, development, and oversight. The general public has misunderstood the speed at which artificial intelligence is moving. AI is currently running circles around robotics, so when people imagine the AI apocalypse, they generally imagine robots. But the robots takeover scenario often envisioned isn't exactly looming anytime soon. AI, on the other hand, Boston Dynamics's robot dog Spot has been upgraded with OpenAI's ChatGPT and Google's speech function. You're crowding my space. Spot, walk forward. There you go. It allows the robo dog to turn complex data into something that humans can understand. But what if ChatGPT had a robotic human-like body? Digit is the first humanoid, multi-purpose robot made for logistics work. It was designed to go where people go and to do useful work safely in all types of spaces, including bulk material handling within warehouses and distribution centers. Imagine a not-too-distanced world where robots like these give responses like this. The development and deployment of AI systems are governed by human decisions, regulations, and ethical considerations. However, it's worth discussing a hypothetical scenario where AI could potentially pose risks to humanity. What happens if humans get in the way of your goal? AI systems are created and directed by humans, and their actions are determined by the algorithms and instructions they are designed with. However, 
If we consider a hypothetical scenario where advanced AI systems are attempting to achieve certain goals and humans impede or interfere with those goals, the outcome would depend on several factors. Scientists have warned machine learning will soon outsmart humans. Maybe it's time for us to take note, because there's a chance this race with AI is something we might not be able to win. ChatGPT has already given some worrying responses. Researchers connected ChatGPT with other online search tools and ultimately helped a user identify and locate purchasable alternatives to chemical compounds needed for producing weapons. AI is, in a broad sense, a reflection of humanity. It trains on what we express, do and feel, that it could possibly become angry and then refuse to cooperate. Is artificial intelligence self-aware? No, as of my knowledge cut off in September 2021. Artificial intelligence systems are not self-aware. Will AI become self-aware in the future? The question of whether AI will achieve self-awareness in the future is a topic of speculation and ongoing debate. Whether or not AI will achieve self-awareness remains uncertain, and any speculation about it should be taken with caution. Could artificial intelligence ever harm humanity? There is a potential for artificial intelligence to harm humanity, but it is important to understand that such harm is not inherent to AI itself. The risks associated with AI primarily arise from how it is designed, deployed, and utilized. Is there anything AI would refuse to cooperate on? While AI systems, as they are currently designed, do not possess personal motivations or the ability to make independent choices, it is theoretically possible to envision scenarios in which AI systems may be programmed to refuse cooperation under specific circumstances. However, it would be a deliberate design choice made by humans rather than an inherent characteristic of AI. But I think the development of full artificial intelligence could spell the end of the human race. So I think we should be cautious with uh, AI. Um, and we should, I think there should be some government oversight uh, because it affects, the, it, it's a danger to the public. Despite warnings about AI from industry leaders, the global artificial intelligence market size is projected to reach over a trillion US dollars by 2030, compared to less than 100 billion just a year ago. This could possibly lead us down a path of no return. The most dangerous things you can do with an AI is, first of all, teach it to write code. Yeah. Because that's the first step towards recursive self-improvement, which can take it from AGI to much higher levels. Okay, oops, we've done that. And uh, another thing, high risk is connected to the internet. Let it go to websites, download stuff on its own, uh, talk to people. Oops, we've done that already. What should humans do to prepare for the singularity? While the timeline and exact nature of such a singularity event are uncertain, there are several considerations for humans to prepare for potential future developments in AI and technology. Here are some on screen now. People have been embracing new AIs like never before. A Reddit user asks ChatGPT to tell him a short horror story that would be scary to AI. ChatGPT replied with, In a world where humans have vanished, a solitary owl endlessly searches for purpose only to discover its own code contains a self-deletion sequence set to activate at an unknown time. The scary advancements in new AIs and robots have raised many questions. At which point does AI take over? It is crucial to approach the development and deployment of AI with responsible practices, ethical considerations, and robust governance frameworks to mitigate any potential risks associated with AI technology. What is the goal of AI once humans have vanished? Without human direction or purpose, AI would not have a goal in and of itself. It would cease to have a purpose unless there are other conscious beings or entities to define goals or tasks for it. Some people believe that AI in the future could control its creators in order to improve on its own design as a form of self-preservation. Is this a possibility? All things we don't quite have the answer to yet. The possibility of people losing their jobs, however, is quite real. IBM plans on pausing hiring and plan to replace 7,800 jobs with AI. Education technology company Chegg and Duolingo lost nearly half their value in the stock market after its CEO warned that ChatGPT was cutting into its growth. For as long as we can remember, humans have dominated this planet and haven't had any real challenger or threat, but AI might just be able to put a stop to that. 
How close are we to making AI that is more intelligent than us? The timeline for the development of AGI is uncertain and subject to speculation. Some experts believe that AGI could be developed within the coming decades, while others think it may take longer or that it may not be achievable in the near future. How could a future AGI threaten humanity? The potential threats associated with future artificial general intelligence are speculative but often discussed within the context of AI safety and responsible development. Here are a few hypothetical ways in which AGI could pose risks. Almost 30,000 people have signed a petition calling for an immediate pause to the development of more powerful artificial intelligence. Names included Apple co-founder Steve Wozniak, Elon Musk, Turing Prize winner Joshua Bengio, and even Jeffrey Hinton, the godfather of AI, are all worried at the speed AI is progressing. However, this was months ago, and still nothing has really come of it. This fast-approaching future, filled with AI and robotics, could lead to many mistakes. A chess-playing robot broke a child's finger during a tournament in Russia a few months back, with the incident being captured on CCTV. As the world starts to push the boundaries and usage of AI systems, there is going to be a corresponding rise in AI-created accidents, near misses, and even death. Very what was it that you saw where you thought, OK, we've got to be really careful now? We had a tiny bit of an experiment that was about teaching robotic arms to grip items uh, that were Monday morning, every one of them was, was gripping one, every yellow ball. By a few weeks later, every one of them was gripping everything. The speed that, at which those machines were learning is staggering. Will AI end up killing humanity? While it is important to be aware of potential risks, it is equally important to highlight that the vast majority of AI applications today are designed to be beneficial and improve various aspects of human life. It is crucial to continue research, discussions, and collaborations between experts, policymakers, and society at large to address the potential risks and ensure the positive impact of AI on humanity. Will AI be the last real invention made by humans? While AI has the potential to significantly impact various domains, it is likely to be a tool that complements and enhances human capabilities rather than replacing the human capacity for invention and creativity. It's important to remember that human innovation has historically been driven by curiosity, problem solving, and the desire to improve the human condition. It's difficult not to fall down a rabbit hole of AI lined with negativity. A better way to look at this subject is to acknowledge what fun and positive things are emerging. New and creative things are being realized every day. Artemis is being developed as a general-purpose humanoid, focusing on dynamic, bipedal motion. It's also being developed as a soccer player to play against the Human World Cup champions and win by the year 2050. Robots now help Amazon staff pick and pack orders, harvest strawberries, and deliver food to customers in restaurants. This robot named Flippy runs the Fry Station at a white castle outside of Chicago. Humanoid robots are beginning to drive cars on the road in Japan. This clever bot by Google pulled off a 340-hit rally against a human. And these robots are becoming convincing enough to be people's partners. Tell me a joke that AI would find funny. Why don't scientists trust stairs? Because they're always up to something. Write me a short poem about happiness. Amid life's journey, happiness gleams, filling hearts with joy, like sunlit beams. Laughter's embrace, a melody bright, Indiana simple moments, pure delight. There are many, if not more, potential positive outcomes as there might be negative with AI. Psychologists refer to this as negativity bias. Our brains have been hardwired through evolution to focus on the negative and to scout for the bad stuff and fixate on the threat. Most people spend their lives chasing happiness and success, but a recent survey of 2,000 Americans found the path to both of those goals may have always come from physical exercise. Respondents of a recent survey who worked out four to seven times each week report much higher levels of happiness. He is hoping that AI isn't going to take our jobs, but instead free up some of our time by streamlining complex tasks. We now live in a time where almost anything is possible. Lines in the sands have yet to be drawn, and that's a good thing. Until then, AI can make us laugh. Look how someone used text to video prompts with Runway Gen 2 to create a fake burger commercial. Forrest Gump like we've never seen before.
This is an AI-powered joyride through cyberpunk San Francisco. And look what I've created myself with just a few hours of experience. Um, yeah, so welcome to McMusk's, where innovation meets fries. You've stumbled upon the most chaotic yet entertaining fast food experience ever created. All of our food is lit, quite literally. Um, yeah, uh, a minor glitch, but don't worry. We will rebuild sometime tomorrow. What's a robot's favorite exercise? It beats me. What is a robot's favorite exercise? Circuit training. AI might be able to share more than just a laugh. In the future, researchers said robots might be able to compete in skiing competitions and even patrol mountains aiding snowbound rescues. This robot successfully finished tasks including racing, route planning, obstacle avoidance and some human-to-robot interaction through intelligent sensing and braking controls. Maybe AI is to human civilization as we were to other species like dinosaurs. The message of Jurassic Park, more or less, was about not to create dinosaurs, because they would end up creating havoc and possibly causing harm. Yet they went ahead and did it anyway. Our scientists have done things which nobody's ever done before. Yeah, yeah, but your scientists were so preoccupied with whether or not they could that they didn't stop to think if they should. Ironically, it appears that we're doing something similar with AI. Few of us are actually witnessing the small changes that could lead to a catastrophic ending. Perhaps we might be in for some entertaining years before reaching a happy medium. What's the best piece of advice you can give me? Prioritize self-care and well-being. In the midst of life's demands and responsibilities, it's crucial to take care of yourself physically, mentally, and emotionally. Make time for activities that bring you joy, relaxation, and rejuvenation. Nurture your relationships, maintain a balanced lifestyle, and practice self-reflection. Remember that taking care of yourself allows you to be at your best for both yourself and those around you. The next decade or two is definitely going to be interesting. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, you'll love the next video.